Alright, so in this video I'm going to show you how to uh, back up your Apple TV if you're on 4.4.4 and you're looking to upgrade to the tethered 5.1 but you're worried about losing your old jailbreak so you should probably back up first. Um, so, you need to run iFaith, so you open up iFaith. I'll open up, click OK. Click dump SHSH blobs, click that. You have to plug in your device, so you take the micro USB cable I've put in here, plug it into the back of that Apple TV. You should see the lights flashing on the front of your device. If you're like me and you don't see those lights, see how I don't see those lights right now? So, what I'm going to do is quickly take the power cord, <clears throat> plug it into the back of the device, you see the lights flashing now, turn it, and then unplug the same power cord, and as you can see it's still flashing even though the power cord's not in it anymore, so then you can click let's go over here, click yes, Click start. It's going to tell you get ready to hold menu in play. So you have your Apple TV remote with you. When you get to that point, you push menu in play at the same time, point it at your Apple TV. And you let go when it tells you to let go. You'll hear a noise. Eventually, this will get this screen. Uh, if iTunes opens, just close it. It's fine. It should still work. Uh, so now it's going to download all these. It's going to ask me where I want to save them. Just pick a spot like where you can keep them in a safe place. So, for example, I just have a desk on my desktop. I have a folder called Blobs. Oh, it's on my desktop here. This folder ATV, and then an the ATV folder. I have a folder called Blobs. I'm just going to create a, fold, a new folder called 4.4.4. This way, if I ever want to revert back to 4.4.4 jailbreak, I can do that without worrying about. Um, losing it completely. And so this thing's still doing its thing down here, but you don't need to see it finished. It's going to ask you where to save it. Save it in that folder that you created, and then you have your Apple TV backed up.